our next destination, the Eastern Federation, where supposedly cute cat girls exist. But surely they're not just going to be cute cat girls. They're going to be a bunch of hairy old men, aren't they? We're getting baited, aren't we? I'm not going to get my hopes up. Let's begin today's reaction. <laughs> Dick size. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Jibber, I get it. He was laughing a lot. And who's in there? Cute cat girls. Come on. This is what I'm saying, bro. This is what I'm saying. Just been gonna be a, it's just gonna be a bunch of old dudes. What? You can see that far? By you, how did you? Okay, whatever. Izuna. Surely this can be the cute cat girl. Don't think of some degenerate shit. What if they read our degenerate minds? Hmm. I think he has some. I don't know. I wonder what his impression of Sora is. Exactly. How does he so far away? Technically, Jupiter will kind of count as a furry girl, right? Yo, what are their fucking eyes? Did you see those girls? Look at us. <laughs> Jibril's pretty funny. Proper procedures. What are we... They're also pissed off. What the... What do we do? Dude, they're all extremely upset. Oh my god, Jibril. Jesus Christ. She is taunting like crazy. <laughs> Just a fucking size comparison. You're, you're, it's a dick measuring contest. <laughs> what a waste of fucking money. Mm. Oh, it's like a bunch of shitters fighting amongst themselves. <laughs> Yo, Chipril is taunting so hard. Still rank six, though. I mean, it's still harder than you, right? A defective monkey. Hairless monkeys! Holy shit. Yo, they're throwing out slurs. <laughs> Those laughs are not very friendly. Yeah, how'd you do that? Huh? What's the hint? Yes, me too. She keeps panting like that, bro. You guessed that he saw you. So he got in a vision with his cell phone. And then he just kind of made an assumption based off of that. Bluff someone that can read their mind. Oh, shit. Okay, who is it? It's a lolly! Alright, we'll take it. It's better, it's better than an old man. Alright, whatever. Even she was into it. Don't worry, I'm just a pervert. Rude! Actually, we're rude for touching her. No, oh, a cute girl that speaks harshly like that. You know, some people like that shit. Let's fight. Mm. Yeah, especially if you call us assholes. It doesn't, you assholes, please. Oh, Grandpa is jacked! Okay, we'll just forget that happened. Gramps is pretty fucking hilarious, too. I like him a lot, actually. I think she kind of likes it. Better than Grandpa? Yo, she threw Grandpa under the bus! Hello. Maybe we can be friends. Oh my god, you're monkeys too! You know, we might be hairless monkeys, you're hairy monkeys! Oh my god, Jibril. Oh my god, Jibril! <laughs> Chipro is so good. She is so good. A game. Duel. <laughs> Steph's panties aren't as rare. I mean, we've taken that shit so many times, but... Hey, no violence allowed. Oh. She'll just get ready right there. Maybe she'll be down. I swear to God. If, she, if he actually says yes to Shiro's panties... What the fuck? I thought he might be- Okay, I thought for a second he was gonna say something there. You know what we want, you can read our minds. Oh, 
パンツよりその副次結果。うん。オタクラのゲームをすべて暴いた俺の記憶を消すチャンスだぞ。But this time we have a little bit more information from the book, right? ホルドリーディング。ワービーストの優れた五感なしでもちょっとしたコツ。観察力さえ。Kind of crazy that they are the beings that can read our minds, but Sora is basically using little cues here and there to kind of understand what he's thinking. He's not mind reading, but he's pretty much understanding. Wasn't a lie, huh? The heartbeat was re、uh, regular. <laughs> yes, blessed you, hairy monkeys. <laughs> the wording. <laughs> you should be glad. You know, you're the first stepping stones. We'll crush you. Everything. I mean, we might as, right? I mean, it's not like we're gonna get a second chance. Nationwide attack. We're gonna bet all of Elkia against all of them. And stiff panties. And, and stiff panties. Yeah, Gramp, this is on you. Now you have to risk the entire nation. And then, lost again. They lost again and again. I don't know how. Why did they quit after that? What did they learn from it? They realized something at the fourth time. What was it? Uh uh. Detective Shiro time. I am confused. Yu Gi Oh! Uh, mind reading! Never mind. A video game where you can mind read all you want. She forgot it all? She wasn't aware of it. All of it. But by even being here, we're already in the game? Is that true? What? Huh? Hmm. You can tell when someone is lying. Yeah, we saw that. Oh, they carry the thoughts. That's quite the guess, though. Lost the question. This is all a bluff. I don't know. I mean, Gramps doesn't have to admit it. True, the previous king did write the, down the notes or something, right? Yes, while he was alive. While he was alive, though. He did. Because、mm -hmm. he was writing all that shit the entire time. That's right. They should have already known if he was writing down the notes, right? If they could truly mind read. Yeah, everyone would fuck him up. All of a sudden, we just got the upper hand. The erasing the memories is still very peculiar. Like, how do they just do that? Big news! Big news! Kick these hairless monkey out! Oh shit, whenever this soundtrack starts playing, you know it's over. The piece, the race piece! What does that truly mean? Oh, everybody's. It glows for all of humanity. I didn't know. For the girls, you know, to try the titties. What happens if you bet a race piece? That's pretty much betting your entire continent, right? All your rights as an exceed. Wait, isn't that a really good thing? Wait, if the pledges doesn't work on us, then we could. No, 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 no. If the pledges don't work, though. Because there's a lot of the things that the pledges are preventing us from doing, though, right? For example, violence. No way, dude. He has to bet his own race piece, too, right? Come on, Gramps. Yes, but Blank never loses. I mean, it's not like he was gonna reproduce, you know? My man is not having kids. Fuck it, let's go. Uh huh. Isekai characters, by the way. We never lose. Let's go, Blank. I love how Hiro keeps completing Shitora's sentences.、Oh, look, the king! The king looks so menacing here! We can never see his face. 
Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Fight right now. Fight right now. Don't. Oh, is this gonna be the setup episode? Uh. Yes, but are you sure you want to risk your race piece? Okay. Lolly versus Lolly, man. Izuna versus Shiro is gonna be so cute. I feel like we could be good friends. Like, Izuna and Shiro could be such good friends. Uh, no. You, you mean challenging every nation and then beat Ted, right? Challenge Ted. Well, it's not like everyone else knows how to get to Ted, because Ted doesn't just approach Steph for Jibro, I don't think. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Our people are all upset. <laughs> ah, shit. Our reputation is not very good. I mean, the moment we took the princess out, you know, making her look like a dog, that was already a bad look enough. Now we've, like, bet everyone's lives here. Is it Izuna? Izuna and Gramps, or who else? What are you talking to? A little, a little pep talk? What's going on? What are these weird cuts of black and white? No, no, well, this isn't really shonen, but you are heroes of a manga. What's going on here with all these different cuts? Like, what's the black and white? Wait, 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 wait. wait. How? Why is Shiro not part of this? post credit scene. That ending just now? Soto was not present. Something is fucked. The ending, it was only Shiro. Are you telling me Soto never existed? What's... Where is Big Bro? No, 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 stop. What do you mean, what Big Brother? Oh, you do know. This isn't some bunny girl senpai puberty syndrome. What's going on? Why does Sora not exist anymore? Huh? I'm so confused. I, 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 I thought we were just gonna go fight the cat girls, but Sora doesn't even exist anymore. How? Why? Huh? There's been one person, I think it's Cedric, that's been on every No Game No Life video saying, please, you have to watch the ending of this episode. You have to watch the ending. I watched the ending, all right? And Shiro, and Sora wasn't there. It's just Shiro. So what's going on? At the end, this ending sequence, you know how Sora was telling Shiro something like, you're, you're, like you'll, you'll do well. You know, like, I believe in you. We're bound by a promise. But then it was like cutting out black and white and he just didn't exist and then the ending it was just Shiro Sora does not exist and now we're back and Steph doesn't even know what Sora is so a couple possibilities the first is I guess we're already somehow playing the game and somehow Sora being gone is an effect of that I don't know I I really don't know I this is some this is some bunny girl senpai puberty syndrome shit I have no clue about. I know how to figure it out though by watching the next episode. So hey, if you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.